Hello, everyone. Welcome to this Wednesday night uh, session of Diversifying Compound. My name is Pascal Defoe. And um, tonight, just like every Wednesday night, we're going to talk about um, you know, the different projects that we, we, we work on. Um, and we're going to uh, share some ideas. And you're welcome to share yours. Uh, but before we start, I'd like to remind everyone that I'm not a financial advisor, nor am I uh, an investment advisor. So I only share general information, um, you know, for knowledge sharing purpose. If you feel like any of the things that we say um, is interesting to you and you want to follow our footsteps, just know that you do it at your own risk. Why am I talking about risk here? Because uh, anything we do involves some investment and any investment involves risk, risk to lose part or all of your capital. So it's very important that you understand that. And um, so before you move forward, uh, know that you know, there's a risk to lose everything. So um, that's the reason why once you choose to do that, please make sure you only invest with money you can afford to lose, okay? Uh, we've seen people losing a lot of money. Uh, so do not use money that you need uh, in a week or two. Uh, make sure you only use money you can afford to lose. You know, an investment, and actually many people that start an investment, I would say probably the majority, not probably, the majority actually lose money. So you don't want to, uh, start that kind of journey um, just to find out that you made the wrong decision. It is very important, especially in the field that we're in, it is very important that you know exactly what you're doing. I see people losing money every single day in the crypto world. One thing you should know when you join the crypto world is that the crypto world is so new, even though it's already like um, almost 13 years old, because it started in the 2019, uh, sorry, uh, 2009 to uh, 2010. So it's almost uh, 12 to 13 years old. And yet we have less than 5% adoption so far. So it is still very new. It is still unregulated in many countries. And for that reason, you have all kind of hackers and scammers that are you know, patrolling pretty much every single group there is. And uh, as soon as you send a message asking for help, guess who shows up first? Uh, they impersonate the admin of the groups that you're in and they come in telling you that they're coming in to help. They'll ask you questions. And before you know it, you've given them all the tools, all the weapons, all the secret phrases that you should normally not share with anyone and before you know it, they, uh, they clean up all of your wallets. So it's very important that, you know, uh, your personal information, such as your password or your seed phrases, that you never, ever share it with anybody. Not even me. Not even me, because I will never ask you for it. I know some people have come to me asking for help with their account and with been in a situation where they needed to share their passwords. But if I come out of the blue asking you for your password, don't share it unless you know you have a problem and you decided to share it with me and you came to me first because I'll never come to you first asking for your password. Anybody coming with an email or a username looking like mine asking you for your password, it's not me. I'll never do that first. All right. So it's very important. You remember that. And anything, anything or any person or any message that ever comes to you with bonuses, you know, anything like you want something, you can't win if you didn't play. So they are scammers. Keep that in your mind. And every time you see something that is too good to be true, that looks suspicious, there's a very big chance that it's a scam. Uh, I wasn't actually planning on doing it, but I'll quickly show you a phishing scam example that was done on my Twitter. And then I'll show you what came out of it after. So 
Um, I'll go ahead and share my screen so I can show you that. And it's very easy to fall for things like that if you are not aware. And that's why I'm saying attending these type of sessions, or if you don't attend for whatever reason, make taking the time to watch the video after the fact is very, very important for every one of you. So I'll quickly share you my, um, I'll share my, uh, my Twitter's account with you guys so you can see uh, the phishing attempt I was victim of. Just bear with me, Twitter, okay, Twitter, Twitter, Twitter. All right, so I'll share my screen. So this is my Twitter account. And uh, um, oh, notifications. OK, I'll take you to the notifications. So the other day, I don't remember exactly when it was. So. I got a message. Aha. Look at this message here. Tron wallet followed you. So this is this thing, Tron wallet followed you. It looks like this. Of course, if you are a user of the Tron wallet and you don't know this, you'd be like, wow, the actual Tron followed me. Who am I for them to follow me? Right? Um, so they followed me and I was like, okay, I kind of went through their stuff and, you know, they were talking about uh, the, uh, the founder of uh, TronLink, you know, they had uh, some kind of information on Tron. So it, to me, it looked like, hmm, what is this? Is it like a new account that they're trying to promote? So, and before I knew it, before I knew it, I got another message later on, because when they followed me, I said, hmm, I will also follow them. Please mute yourself if you don't mind. Just bear with me, I need to mute. Uh, okay, I think the person muted themselves. So before I knew it, because I followed them back because I was like, okay, if Tronlink people follow me, who am I not to follow them, right? That was my first reaction. And then before I knew it, I got a message from them. Uh, I'm not sure how to, let me see. Aha, here it is. Introducing team conversation. This one here, all right, so I'll click it. So before I knew it, I got this message. Congratulations, you are the lucky active user to get 25,000 Tron. Coin airdrop. If you remember my presentation on security, if you remember it well, I always told you avoid airdrops. That is the easiest way to open your door, okay? That's a Trojan horse. That's the easiest way to open your door to hackers. They tell you, oh, you want this? It comes as an airdrop. You need to click on something in order to claim it. Many people that go after any kind of airdrops will, of course, click on that, okay? Many people would click on that, and before they know it, they would, it, it would be too late because um, I could delete this. I kept it because I wanted to show it to you guys. So many people would click on those links, and before they know it, their wallet will be compromised. It happened to, uh, to uh, one of my downline and before his own eyes, he saw them sweeping away his $5,000 on MetaMask. I don't know exactly what he did, but he made a mistake somewhere along the way. And as a result, he lost money. So it is very important. I will never stop reminding you guys about all these people. Okay, so this is an example. They tell you you want 25,000 Tron. If you do the math, 
you and check how much 25,000 drone is, that is quite a lot of money right now. Maybe not hundreds of thousands of dollars, but still, that is quite a lot of money. I think the Tron right now is at uh, 0 0.07, so around seven cents. So if you do seven cents times this, if it was even just one cent, that's already 250. Now multiply 250 times seven. That's how much it is. So many people will actually click on that, okay? So it's very important you stay away from this kind of message. It will always look very genuine and it will look like it comes from either someone you trust and know or an organization that you trust or know. Um, this is one. Another one I was looking at the, uh, yesterday um, as I was posting the French, um, the French Zoom we had on, on Sunday. Um, I'll show you the next one. I didn't click on it because I knew what it was. I just want to change the, the tab here and I'll show it to you on, on YouTube. Many people fall for that. I did fall for it in the past. So that's why I know this one for sure. Uh, YouTube, YouTube, where do I find that? Okay, let me just go on YouTube. And it's very important that you all know these. Um, it comes in the form of a very well-known person, all right? A well-known person that is live talking about a specific subject. And then you see them and you're like, oh, wow, it's live. And they would then have some giveaway around the thing. And before you know it, you go find out what is going on and uh, you get caught up. Let me see if I can find, okay. They took that one down. It was, um, what's his name? Uh, Elon Musk. Let me see if I can find. I'll just type Elon Musk live. And you cannot imagine the amount of people that fall for them every single, every single time. Every single time. Look at this one. Uh, giving, he, they'll tell you he's giving away something. Okay, they don't have it right now, but um, that's another thing. So you'll usually find those, okay, look at this. Elon Musk, Tesla accept payment, Ethereum, Bitcoin, and so on, live now. Forget it, the guy is not live. That's a good example. He's not live, right? And they'll tell you, oh, they, they, they'll give you this if you do that, and then you will send them something. Look at how many of them are saying, the guy's live. He's not live. All right. I'll click on it just so you see what, what it is about. Look at this. He's actually talking and it looks like it is genuine and it looks like it is live. They tell you to participate in BTC, you will need to send them something. So uh, we will send you back 0 0.2. So all you need to do is you send 0 0.1 BTC, between 0 0.1 BTC to 100 BTC to a special address, and then they will send you uh, the double, okay, 2X. You could take part in with Ethereum as well, okay? You could do the same thing with Ethereum. They tell you here that if you send 25 BTC, they're going to give you 50 BTC. Right, you cannot imagine the amount of people that fall for that. And this is just an example. I, I didn't even know it was still on, so I was just looking. So, and if you say go to the website, it's going to take you to a website, and then they're going to give you an address there. If you actually look this particular name up on Google and you say scam, you will see a lot of people asking, "Is this true? Is this true?" Because some people, before they actually ask, they've already sent money. They've already sent some cryptos, all right? Tesla live now, forget it, he's not live, okay? So this is one of such scam thing that people fall for. If I take this one, it also looks like the guy's in his, I don't know where, and is having a live, another live feed. 
Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let me, let me, because uh, you, I know you're only seeing the uh, the pictures. You're not, you're not actually hearing it. So I'll share again and share the sound as well. Okay. So we were on this one now. Look at this one. It looks so original and true. It's, uh, a noble social goal. But so before... we expand social to be m much more than uh, the traditional ESG community. And then on governance, you've got uh, the transparency of the ecosystem. Uh, you know, uh, it's completely transparent, unlike uh, the opaqueness. Right. So when you look at something like this, and if you are, you you will actually, you know, you see someone like Elon Musk, you see someone like Jack Dorsey, right? And they talking and they telling you it is live. Who are you not to believe that? Who are you not to believe it, right? And then before you know it, you will click and do exactly what they're telling you to do here. And of course, your money is gone. Your money is gone. You can actually, uh, if you even click on the website, where's the website? I'll show you the website. Uh, Elon Musk, show less. Okay, I don't know how they actually, you actually even get to their website where they give you all the information. But how, do, how to participate? So basically you go to that website, you go to that website and- So that gives me a great degree of confidence that, uh, you know, they, they do believe they, they're on a noble mission. They could be paid a lot more than they're being paid right now if they worked at Google or, or Facebook or, or some of these other areas, but they've chosen, uh, you know, um, this sense of purpose for a new- Right, if you look here on the, on the right, Elon Musk and R invest Ethereum and Bitcoin price. This is scam, this is fake, right? Look at this one, look at this one. Look at, look, just look how many are available. I think they also have some on uh, on on uh, Binance uh, guy on Binance uh, CZ. So there's so many of them. So never fall for this, please. Uh, you who are connected right now, as well as you who will be watching this video tomorrow, it is very important that you know. Uh, it's sad that you 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 try to invest your hard-earned money, and there are people spending time trying to steal it away from you. Um, so please do what it takes, get the right, um, not just information, but get the right training, get the right training in order not to lose your money in a stupid way. Okay. Because things like this, you will, you will see them so many times and you will not always recognize them. Nobody gives these things for free. Nobody's out there you know, out there uh, giving away Bitcoin for free. I know we have Bitcoin um, um, things and, 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 and Ethereum in, in, in the Hyperverse community, but they are selling it for a discounted price. And they are able to sell it for a discounted price because they are farmers. They farm those cryptos, right? So they have them because they own farms, right? Farming uh, facilities that mine those cryptos. These guys are nobody. So I know Elon Musk has a lot of Bitcoin that, he's, that he bought, but he's not giving away anything, okay? So stay away from that. I hope this uh, little reminder will again, uh, remind everybody to stay away from too easy money. Stay away from too easy money. There is more and more, there is more and more of those opportunities that come out telling you that, oh, you know what, the other one doesn't work anymore. You should join this one. Um, trust me, if it is too good to be true, it is too good to be true. I'll name it. C-O-T-P, I don't know how to say the word. Many people, that's one that is very high profile right now. Many people are joining it. But again, um, people are making money. Making money is not the proof that something is right or that something is legit.
I was approached so many times already by so many people that are even my, you know, above me in, in Hyperverse and Daisy. But I told them, I'm sorry. I'm not taking anybody into that shit. Sorry, my language. I'm not taking anybody in there. I cannot consciously bring somebody into something I know it's a scam because that is a scam. If you cannot explain clearly where the money comes from, then I'm sorry. Do not invite anybody in there. If you want to lose your money, go on your own, but do not invite somebody in there. So to me, I don't know how that COTP thing makes money. I know, I'm pretty sure many of you have been approached to join it. Maybe some of you are even in there making money right now. Just keep one, just keep one thing in mind. You'll make money now, the next person you will bring in when they don't make money, how do you feel? Because it's always like that. It always ends like that. It always ends like that. So what is your best bet? Right? What is your best bet? Do you want to keep going around like a dog chasing their tail? You know, going from one project to another that you know will fail eventually so that the day you actually have the real deal, you won't even be able to talk to somebody because they've been scammed, they've been burned so many times, right? It's important that we know exactly what battle we fight. Anyway, so once again, stay clear from scam. There's a lot of it. So the two that I showed you tonight are just two little examples, okay? So don't click on anything you don't know who sent it. Don't click on anything you don't trust because you do that, you lose your money. Now, um, the next thing I would like to cover 